The croc hesitates, then slips back into the tea-colored depths. Weeks pass. Wet season floods swell the channels. Spinosaurus now stalks in three dimensions, marching the riverbed on ballast-heavy legs while buoyant lungs keep its eyes just below the rippled surface. From beneath, it rockets upward, seizing unwary pterosaurs skimming for bait fish. Yet the very waters that empower this river monarch hide a fatal weakness. When monsoon rhythms falter, the mighty channels shrink to green-stranded pools. Fish stocks crash, scavenging crocs move in. By the late Cretaceous, shifting seas and creeping deserts erase the watering highways Spinosaurus depends upon. The sail that once sliced dawn mist now lies entombed in Saharan sandstone, a jagged ridge of fossil bone baking beneath an unrelenting sun. Still, every unearthed vertebra whispers of a hunter unlike any other, half reptile, half river, pure terror and grace entwined in one vanished breath.